chance, one chance You, you will never regret The things that we'll do Cause I As you saw yesterday, um, we loaded up the whole movie truck. It literally took all day long. We were at the storage unit for like maybe an hour and then the whole rest of the day we were packing everything else up and we didn't get to bed until, <laughs> bless you, we didn't get to bed until, I don't know, past midnight last night and then we woke up at six this morning to get going. So our plan was to leave at seven. Hi, Hi Annie but it is 7.40, so we left at 7.30, which isn't too bad for getting the rest of the things in the car, plus two babies. So, I did not really get ready today. I threw in a little bit of mascara, threw my hair a bit of ponytail, because I know I'm probably gonna be sweating today. It, is, it has been super hot here in Utah, and we're gonna be having to carry lots of things, so. Anyway, gonna be a crazy day today. I'm gonna try and film as much as I can. Um, but I've got the two crazies back here, and um, I've got Carl. Let's see if you can see him. Anyway, those lights back there are the U-Haul. So, anyway, gonna be a very exciting day, hopefully. We have people coming to help us. We texted people at our new church and um, they were trying to find some people, but it is a work day, so we'll see if anybody shows up. If not, then we will just figure it out and it will be fine. But anyway, it's gonna be a crazy day. I'm excited for everything to just be done already. So anyway, that is what's going on this morning so far. Okay, it is actually 10.45 now. Um, and I didn't film any of the stuff going inside the apartment because we had people from church helping us and I didn't want to make them feel uncomfortable with the camera in their face, but I will show you everything that's going on whenever we get back to the house, but we have not eaten yet, so I just picked up some corner bakery for breakfast and, um, it's kind of funny because I don't know if you can see, it might be too bright, literally like right there that building was um, gonna be our apartment 
but we declined that one, but it would have been so nice because it would have literally been like a 30 second walk to Corner Bakery, but we now live like two minute drive away, which isn't too bad, but anyway, um, the apartment is very, very small. It's not cute at all. It's student housing, but we're gonna make it cute and make it fun, so. Anyway, I'll show you guys what's going on way back to the house. Everett is kind of a disaster. He obviously woke up way too early. He's been like screaming all day long. So anyway, just making the best of the day. It, so grateful that we had those guys because otherwise we would have been here all day trying to unload the truck ourselves. All right, guys, I am back at the house now. Um, let me warn you, it's not a very cute apartment whatsoever but I'm gonna give you a little mini tour. So, it's just a little tiny place, but when you first come, this is the front door. Here is storage, and then here is, I guess it's supposed to be the pantry. So, kind of ugly right inside the door, but oh well, and then there's a coat rack. And then here is just big open space has ugly cinder block walls, but that's fine. And the teeny tiniest kitchen ever. Um, but here's a cute baby. So my plan for in here is I think we're gonna have the couch going this way, and then our pink chair right there. We have our cute rug, and then the TV and um, entertainment stand. We'll just go underneath the window here, which will be fine. Um, we might move things around, who knows. And then right behind the TV we'll have our dining table, like right in this area. And then here is the itty bitty ugly kitchen with like the miniest stove. <laughs> very, very outdated. They're actually tearing down these apartments slowly and um, they're gonna rebuild all of the family housing here on campus, but. And then I'll show you Everett's room later, but that will be the boys' room. And then this is where a washer could go, a dryer has to go inside of our bedroom, so we'll probably just use the laundry room here um, in the building. And then here's the bathroom, so it's just a sink, mirror, toilet, and then the shower. But I just brought this in here so that we would obviously have storage in our bathroom for hair stuff, makeup, all that kind of stuff. Um, and then here is our bedroom. The rooms are extremely tiny. Our king bed is barely going to fit in here, um, but we're going to make it work. And then here is the closet. So I'm about to start working on our clothes right now, but here's my side. And then Carl's side will be over there. He has the blue hangers. So anyway, it is just gonna have to do we have already met some people that are so so nice and they have kids and I think we're gonna have a lot of fun with the families here and then um, let me see if you can see this or if it's too bright I might have to turn down the brightness but let's see here um, outside every single like group of apartments there is a playground so there's a playground and then like a basketball hoop so that is going to be super nice for Everett and Carl loves to play basketball. So literally we walk out our door and there's like a playground. So that is going to be super fun. So I um, started doing the pantry, but I don't know where the rest of the pantry boxes are. So now I'm just going to work on like all of these bags, our clothes, and we have some boxes. All of these bags are clothes. So... Um, we have a lot of clothes that we need to do so anyway that is what's going on now I did not film any more yesterday because <coughs> things got a little bit crazy and Everett was in a terrible mood. But it is the next day. Carl is trying to set up the Wi-Fi. We have gotten so much done. All this space was full of boxes and suitcases. Um, the rest of this still looks the same, but we're getting super close to being done. Um, we have 
Everett's sleeping right now. And Hazy Boy's over here in the swing. But um, we got our bed set up yesterday. Takes up pretty much the whole entire room, but at least we have our king size bed back. It feels so nice. And then here we have bins and my shoes. And then um, I have it, I like to color cord, color coordinate all of my clothes so this is not how they're gonna be but they go back to there and then Carl's stuff is on this side and his shoes are right there so we got all of our stuff done next stuff next stuff is gonna be the baby's room a bunch of their clothes are here um but Everett is obviously sleeping in there so our goal is to have pretty much everything done today, so um, we're going to get our furniture set up, TV set up, everything pretty much set up, um, the pantry, I think we put all of our pantry stuff in here for now, not organized really, but um, as that, this is all the boxes that I unpacked yesterday, so things are moving along, right love? Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. All right, well, that is all. My heart is beating to your drum And I'm blinded by the sunshine in your eyes Not thinking twice in my this dumb Although I know you're all I want How could I crave something so bad? My sweaty palms reveal a warning I should hear But I don't care, you drive me mad I'll ignore the truth and run to you So we could drive away You'll hear me say Everything is gonna be okay I don't need nobody else Obsessed with you Try to stop me But I'm under your spell Can't help myself You know too well going to show you um, kind of our more done house tour. We have pretty much everything done. So, remember, coming through the door right here. Bless you! And then here's the pantry. And then we just have Everett's, no, Hayes's car seat here. And then this is just a storage room that is packed full with extra stuff. And then this is a living room. So, this is where Hazy hangs out sometimes. And then the TV. And all of our cute furniture. Of course, Puppy and Buckley are always around. Right? <laughs> and then here's our new microwave that we had to buy because this place didn't come with the microwave. And then here's our dining room. Everett, say hi! <laughs> and I got these cute flowers from Trader Joe's yesterday. And then here is the little kitchen. Everything is pretty packed in here. We had to cook on this stove last night and it was a tight fit cooking two things on there. So that's going to be a challenge sometimes. I want to get a entryway table for right here. I found one at Target yesterday, but maybe one day we'll get it, right? Yes. <laughs> it was really cute and that'll hide all this Wi-Fi stuff. but. Um, then you come back here, and this is Everett's room, and one day Hayes' room in a few months. But I have a hamper and dresser here, and then I'm going to hang up Everett's sign up here. My mom made that for him. It's really cute. This is his toy corner over here, and then his crib area. I was going to put at the old house, I had his name sign here, but um, we just put his camera there because that was the only place with the outlet. And then here's our closet, pretty packed full of stuff. We have all their diapers, wipes, some extra toys and books, his shoes and baby carrier, and then just is just like storage stuff, and then all their hanging stuff. And then we have more boxes over there with like Everett's old clothes that Hayes will soon fit into. And then over here is our room. 
So we have our bed. I'm wanting to switch out our pillows sometime and get on new pillows. Um, and then obviously this is where Daisy Boy sleeps. Um, and then we also have a really good sized closet. I have not um, organized my clothes yet. I like to do them in rainbow order, but there's like all of our stuff in here. And then we also have shelves in here of all of our stuff. And then our laundry hampers will go in here once I do everything because my dresses will be at the end of the um, rack. So our hampers will probably fit right there. And then here is the tiny little bathroom. What's wrong? You want some juice? Um, here's the tiny little bathroom. So here's the sink. We have storage in here. And our towels, toilet, the shower. And then um, this, the cubby little system. And this cubby is supposed to be right here. Okay, so then it goes like that, but this is just what we had from the old place. <laughs> Nothing really matches, and then back here we have my shower cap and the boys' towels, and then this stuff will obviously didn't go into the shower. This is my makeup, which will go into one of these cubbies as well. So, anyway, that is the whole entire tour. So I hope that you guys enjoyed this video. It's been like almost a week in the making, but I finally got it done. So if you did enjoy it, please give it a thumbs up. It really supports my channel. Make sure that you are subscribed so that you don't miss any of my future videos. And I will see you guys in a few days. Bye.